Finally tonight, the power of a picture. When one Florida photographer pointed her camera at a stray dog, she made an emotional connection that's making a difference for hundreds of animals now. NBC's Lily Luciano has the story. Four-year-old Colin Smith's parents already had their hands full, just looking after a preschooler. The last thing they had in mind was getting a dog, until they saw that first unforgettable photo of Callie, a two-year-old pit bull mix that had the good fortune of being rescued by a professional photographer, Ginger Monteleone. All right. Ginger couldn't keep her, so to find Callie a new family, she did what came naturally. Do you want to use the training lead? She had the dog post. It's all right. Snapped her picture and posted it on her Facebook page. There was one picture of her with Callie that had like reading glasses on. <laughs> it was just adorable. Exactly the reaction Ginger was looking for. Someone who would fall so in love with Callie's photo that they then would fall for the dog itself. Ginger has a way of taking pictures where she can really capture the personality of the dog. And she did that with Callie. Ginger makes her living photographing Miami's mansions, high-end condos, and pricey yachts up for sale. But when she saw how a good photo of Callie won the dog a home, she began pointing her lens at rescue animals. Hi! <laughs> I had a skill. I take photos. You know, I'm a photographer. So I wanted to give that. Debbie Day says Ginger's photos are making the difference between life and death for the dogs at her rescue group. It's color, it's depth versus flat, it's warm and fuzzy. A stark contrast to the typical mugshots of the animals available at shelters. Poorly shot pictures, usually taken soon after a frightened or lost animal is caged. Since she started last summer, Ginger's photos have helped place hundreds of homeless pets. The Humane Society of America says more than half of all dogs and cats that enter shelters each year don't survive. That's some four million animals nationwide. And the problem is getting worse, not better. The pace with which people are adopting just has not kept up with the numbers of animals that are surrendered, and it's a race against time every single day. A race Ginger is helping lucky dogs like Callie win. <laughs> Lilia Luciano, NBC News, Miami.